Hey guys, it's me, Zell, and we are here with an exciting new content from Star Wars, The Tales of the Jedi. Kind of something that snuck in there. I didn't really hear a lot about it or had a lot of speculations about it until that trailer came out. So I'm super excited. It's only six episodes long and they're like relatively short episodes, but um, I'm hoping it'll make me like a certain someone better if you guys have been watching my star wars journey i'm not a huge fan of count dooku just for me he's a little bit boring um even watching the clone wars and stuff i think the most exciting episode i liked with him was when he and anakin and qui-gon or obi-wan sorry were entangled and captured with a uh, ando so that was entertaining. But besides that, I just found it was a little bit lackluster for me. Anyways, regardless, I'm just excited to learn more about his character and get in depth. But also, you know, it'll be interesting to learn a little bit more about the beginnings of Ahsoka, which I'm assuming we're going to get, which is this what this first episode is, which is um, life and death. It's the beginning with Ahsoka. And I'm hoping they will please. It would not make sense if they didn't, but please show Plo Koon. He's my, one of my favorite Jedi and or just characters in general in Star Wars. So any more Plo Koon that I can get in his wholesomeness is delightful. So um, yeah, so it'll be interesting to see the beginnings and a little bit more about Ahsoka. We definitely get a lot of Ahsoka in Star Wars. We get her in Clone Wars. We've got her in Rebels. We got her in live action. So we're gonna even going to get her own show. So we are like fully fleshed out with Ahsoka and getting more and more about her. So I guess I'm assuming we're going to get some of the earlier years right before she gets plucked to the Jedi and then maybe some of her pre- Anakin days. I don't know. We're going to see. We'll find out. Regardless, I'm excited. Hope you are too. So let's get going with the first episode, Life and Death, Tales of the Jedi. <laughs> A baby is born. She's here. It's a girl. Oh, <laughs> what a great village. I've always loved village and community vibes when there's just like this togetherness. Oh, oh, Ahsoka's mommy. Oh, here comes the village wise one. They're a bit short too. Don't they usually say the longer they are as they age? But her seem maybe they do like humans. They start to shrink. Ahsoka. I know that Torgruta are mostly hunters, so I'm not seeing any farming in their village. And they interesting, they have droids within the, within the village. Oh, she just has little nubbins. Are you sure? Oh, she she's looks ready? so much like her. Nakil, you it is insult custom. the spirits, the trees, ancestors. All right then. I meant no offense. <laughs> Very so cute. Oh my gosh. Yep. Just going hunting from the get go. Hunting, Bafti. Well, they're obviously gathering some materials, but yeah, mom's going out there. Just had birth. <gasps> what are those creatures? They're like loth cats, but dog pandas. Oh, it's like Lion King. Too am I. Too am I. All right. The title's called Life and Death. Don't do this to us. That baby face and sounds are too cute. They know we got one over by Grogu, so here we are. Look, Asuka. What in the? That's cool, but I feel like my allergies are going crazy right there. Oh, she looks so much like Ahsoka, but just subtly enough different. Oh, meerkat esque. Standing up on them hind quarters. <laughs> Only two ran away. Oh. Now end its suffering. You must face death, oh. Ahsoka. Don't 
will not fear it. Just exposing them early. That is interesting, though, you know? Trying to teach early on that death is just facing it. It's a reality. Oh, no. I shall carry you. Oh, no. Take the Kaibuk, take the Kaibuk. She's like facing death, mom, just like you taught me. No. No. Just runs off with the baby. We obviously know she's okay, but. Ahsoka. Which is interesting, though, he's carrying it off. There's something more than just food, otherwise he he would eat and take the kai bucks easy. Of course. Really, you are hungry. Gosh, she freaking commanded. Wait. Oh, my gosh. Rakshir, do we mind? Smart creature. They're like, okay, something's different with her. <laughs> I think the wise one knows Gandaga. this. How could this be? Jedi. Ahsoka is Jedi. Wouldn't she just say force user? Oh, she's so tired. And the I they obviously assuming she's wants to go to the Jedi, but Wow. Well, cool. So here we go. We have the first episode down. No one died, but it was exposing and talking about death, right? You know, seems to be kind of that tradition they have in their village to go out and do the hunt, which is what helps keep them alive and what they do in their village and then facing the death that is an ultimate reality when they do this hunting. So um, very cool. And again, I'm assuming I want to say Sabretooth, but it's probably something else. <laughs> but yeah, so the the Sabretooth uh, tiger, again, interesting enough, if I'm thinking about my what makes sense logically, biologically is let's take that dead large carcass for food instead of this small thing that's not going to feed as much and could potentially bite back, right? And have the humans or sorry, the Torgruta after you, right? Um, but he went for, which shows more of an intel, intelligence, maybe if he's being spiteful and taking the young of, of this, uh, person that was fighting against the, the creature. Yeah. So I thought it was maybe something more than that. Cause he carried it all the way back to a safe spot and then was going to eat and feast. Um, but that's just me. <laughs> being particular overall very cool though i you know it's interesting like ahsoka it's not necessarily you know suggested ever really that she's has like a direct connection to like animals like that's not like her specialty per se like ezra from rebels like that's kind of something he's known for um another jedi but obviously she makes a connection because assuming this is a very intelligent creature and is aware and she's able to stop in its tracks from eating her but then also command it or maybe ask it seems almost more so to return her back to the village and it did and you could see the eyes and the connection and that understanding they 
it had with the mom. So yeah, it was really interesting. We got to meet Ahsoka's parents, Pavti, and he only said his name once, but, and then Gantka, interesting uh, village wise one, um, basically teaching them about, I think she's a force user, she's a Jedi, so, but yeah. Love the animation, love the music. Kevin Kleiner comes back, love to see it. We get to kind of see a little bit about what the Torgruta or at least um, Ahsoka's um, village was like and the community aspect around it. And the, you know, it's kind of a classic village depiction. You have the older wise one, right? And you have everyone gathering around and working together, um, hunting a survival, um, working on upkeep of the village. But yeah, I love it. It's great. It's really fun to see that uh, baby Ahsoka is adorable. We got to meet, or maybe we've seen them before, but I want to say call them Loth puppies. <laughs> they're not Loth because they're not on Loth, but we'll just, they look very similar to the cats, but space puppies. And uh, Kai Bucks, maybe we've seen them before, but interesting to see those basically like gazelles with the meerkat stance. Gazelles, you know. <laughs> But yeah, anyways, ramblings aside, I love what I saw so far. Again, music was good, art, artists, artistry was good. The story was well done. Voice acting, of course, always phenomenal. So I'm excited to see what's in store next. So, hey guys, thanks for watching. If you wanna support, you know what to do. Don't forget to give the thumbs up on the video if you've liked it. If you made it this far, you liked it. And if you wanna subscribe, I certainly recommend it. That'll be the best way to alert when my videos go live, as sometimes it's not, I don't really have a consistent posting schedule. So just subscribe. I won't overwhelm you with videos. You could turn on notifications, it'll pop up. Everyone's happy, everyone wins, so do it. And yeah, on that note, thanks again for being here and I will see you on the next one.